Well, and Johnny Palacio is going to be pretty rough, pretty tough, and it's going to be based once again on strength. Once again on strength, and of course a bit of brain power in this. Well, Johnny Palacio, the Italian stallion, also knowing all the dirty tricks in the book, I can tell you that much. The Archangel taking control of this one, Johnny Palazzo, the man with the biggest ego I've ever come across. That is an act of coward, is right there jumping out the ring trying to catch his breath. And the Archangel loving it. Well, I see he left uh, his lady friend, his manager, Tiger, at home. Johnny Palazzo going out the Archangel. Very tough customer. That is a low blow right there, smack to the face and arrogant, and he's made it on the clothesline. Oh, come on, Johnny Gallagher. Oh, and he's been taken down there by Archangel. Well, Archangel exploded here, and Johnny Palazzo's out to dig in front of him. Oh, well, move the Italian Stalin trying to catch his breath. He went down on his head really hard, complaining to the ref. He had no hair. Come on, Johnny, get in there and show us what you made of. Well, Johnny Palazzo had. Uh, the bit in his teeth earlier on uh, in this match and how quick the tide can turn. Trying to get down the arm, trying to wear the arm down. One way of getting a uh, custom out, you take a body part, you concentrate on it, the Archangel saying, I'm not having any of that, fighting back with a huge right hand and huge, huge close to the chest and those burn, you should know. Well, they do burn indeed and you can hear them right in the top seats of the Westwick Tennis Stadium and that the shoulder being buried there into the stomach. And what a mega, mega uh, monkey flip there by Archangel on uh, Johnny Palacio and Palacio is in trouble at this point, Stan. He's clearly not on the same page as the Archangel. Line close line of the top rope. Or shall I say the bottom rope? Well, you've been confused since we came to sit down. You thought we were, we were in Joba at one stage. <laughs> well, obviously, if you're sitting next to somebody like you, it tends to break your concentration from time to time. You come here very jacked up, and I get to sit next to someone like you. What do you expect? That's a Johnny common turn. That's this shit out, Johnny boy. Johnny Palazzo, the Italian stallion, showing why he's great. With a big hip toss takedown out of the corner there. And he's giving it back. Oh, look at that. Look at that. He's got the knee down. I didn't, I didn't think that he would get a, a three count on that one. The Archangel in a lot of trouble, but he's got the crown support once again. He needs to get out of it. He needs to break that hole. The choker applied at the moment. Slowly but surely, it weighs down any opponent. Well, it's a sleeper hole there, and uh, it looks like as if Archangel's got out of it and reversed it, and uh, Johnny Palazzo back in trouble again. Well, that's a big takedown there by Archangel on uh, Johnny Palazzo. Flat on his back, and now Archangel going for a submission move. The Angel, no, no soft customer either. Always up for it. He doesn't, that's one thing about the guy, he does not care about size. He's in there for the taking and he gets into every match to win. Johnny Palacio, a very, very angry man indeed. Archangel trying to regroup. He's been bitten and hit like it's been a low blow. The ref needs to open his eyes. The official 
He's really blind. Come on, Robert Mayer. Things have changed. Um, huge, huge arm, arm right to the face of Johnny Palazzo. Your Italian stallion in a lot of trouble at the moment. He needs to do something to get out of this really fast. Well, that was a cross uh, body dive and the two of them collided in the center of the ring. And now the modified suplex. It's a one count. It's only a two count. And look at that. Johnny Palazzo kicking out of that one. thinking inside the ring there by Archangel for sure. Without a doubt. Italian standing in a lot of trouble but no, no fool himself trying to get to the ropes. But what is the Angel doing? He's taking him to the middle of the ring, the middle of nowhere, no man's land. And Johnny Palaccio needs to get out of this really fast. Well, I've felt that one before. It feels like the shoulder is going to pop out and then he still get the boot in between the shoulder blades as well. It is not a nice move, and or should I say, not a nice position to be in. And just the fact that Palazzo has got up to his feet there shows a lot of charisma. Going for the cover, it's a two count. And very close, good move as well. Well, you can imagine now that the shoulders and uh, the upper back of Johnny Palazzo is very, very sore at this point in time. He's obviously in a world of hurt. Submission move from Johnny Palancia, the Archangel saying, no, I want to continue this. Of course, this man goes the distance regardless of who the opponent is. Pure well, frustration from Palancia's side. Well, they're right on the, uh, to the back there um, of, uh, of Archangel. And uh, Palancia clearly, as you said, this time, how are you doing to get a The lights are getting out for the Archangel slowly but surely needs to just compose himself, get his breath and focus on the man in the ring and what a move! Well there was a drop kick there by Johnny Palaccio, it's a one count, it's a two count and this time Archangel gets the power from somewhere, gets the arm up and oh look at that swing in the there by Archangel and all of a sudden from being on top of his game here, Johnny Palaccio finds himself in a choke about 20 seconds ago, he was the man in control.